Yes, uh, the background is that in 1668, uh, Nicholas Mercator, a German mathematician who'd come to live in England, uh, published a book in which there was one single example of an infinite series. Uh, a rather trivial example in a way. For, for Newton, this would have been an easy example, but nevertheless, Newton worried that Mercator and perhaps other people were beginning to catch up with his discoveries. And at this stage, I think he, he panicked slightly and decided to write down what he knew to, to make it public so that he could claim ownership of it. And so he began to write up the things he discovered in the 1660s, earlier 1664 and so on. And this uh, was written in a very interesting treatise, which we now know as De Analisi. And this document he showed to just two people. One of them was Isaac Barrow in Cambridge, his tutor in Cambridge. The other was John Collins in London. Uh, John Collins was a member of the Royal Society uh, and collected mathematical documents, very interested in mathematical documents. So these two people alone saw this uh, manuscript. Barrow would certainly have recognised the importance of it. I think Collins also did, although Collins probably didn't understand it very well, but it, he saw enough to recognise that here was something important. So in a way, in putting this out, Newton was laying claim to his discoveries without actually publishing them in print.